Space Explorers between the lines. And three, two, one, go. Blue Alliance here with the potential to earn three more points from crossing the half line compared to the Red Alliance. The Blue Alliance starting two robots on level two. Red Alliance only starting one. An impressive move on the Red Alliance by the Pascac Pioneers. They were able to get a hatch panel up on the third level of a Red Alliance rocket before the sandstorm period comes to a close and driver vision is restored. So far, all three robots for both alliances sticking to their side of the field and offensive strategies. But that now changes as the Robo Bees cross over to the Blue Alliance side of the field. It looks like they're trying to play interference on SCH Vulcan Robotics, but as quickly as they come over, they change strategies and head over to the other side of the field the long way. They drive back over and push back Mars Wars. That slows Mars Wars down. They're trying to place a hatch panel on the upper level of the Blue Alliance rocket. And as they back away, they drop that hatch panel. 36 to 34, Red Alliance advantage at T minus 80 seconds. We're seeing speed out of Michigan, another placed hatch panel. One Red Alliance rocket with five hatch panels, the other with three. Mars War is still struggling to place a hatch panel on the upper level of the Blue Alliance rocket. The defense from the RoboBees making it very difficult for them to have the time they need to place that hatch panel securely. Mars Wars deciding no longer to work with hatch panels. They grab cargo from their loading zone and bring it over to the cargo ship to successfully score. That defense coming from the Robo Bees is giving the Red Alliance the opportunity to build their score. They now have a 13 point lead at T minus 35 seconds. We're now seeing the PASCAC Pioneers and Speed work together on a Red Alliance rocket that is very close to being fully loaded. Speed trying to load the second to last cargo pod inside as we enter the end game period. Only one more cargo pod needed to fully load that rocket. Speed coming in to deliver at 10 seconds remaining. Their partners, the Robo Bees, up on level three. The Red Alliance does it with six seconds to go. They have a fully loaded rocket. And match 47 in the books. This one's going to red. With a final score of 88 to 82, the Red Alliance plays a perfect